A woman making Latin American comfort food is breaking barriers at a farmer's market in Wayne. It is, of course, Women's History Month, and CBS News Philadelphia reporter Marcella Bayado shares how this woman is spreading her love for empanadas while representing her culture. These golden brown empanadas infused with an array of sweet and savory fillings have become much more than just a crispy handheld staple at the Lancaster County Farmers Market. I usually call them pockets of love. Veronica Fitzgerald first started making the fried on the go meals for her friends and family in 2009 as a way to tap into her Ecuadorian culture after moving to the U.S. at 14 with her family. And I just decided to teach myself how to make some of the things that brought me back to when I was young and my tradition. Fast forward and V Empanadas was born. We're making about 3,000 of them a month is a lot. All those empanadas have led her to become the first Latina-owned business to have a stand at the market since it started back in 1929. We have a lot of people um, around here that work and support this market that are Latin, but to actually have the spot and to offer Latin fare to, um, to people here is amazing. She's also offering other Latin small businesses a chance to showcase their own products at her stand, too. Take care. To prepare for orders, Fitzgerald first gets the dough ready, scoops in the desired filling, and uses a mold to close up the empanada before it's fried up and ready for a taste test. That's like the first one I, um, I started making. That, that was my first one ever. She can now hand make 65 of them in just an hour. But juggling a successful business and a family wouldn't have been possible without support from those around her, like her father, who helps out at the market. When she needs, I have to be here. She hopes to inspire others to take on new opportunities and always lean on the ones. I'm very lucky. <laughs> and the food that bring you comfort. In Wayne, Marcella Bayetto, CBS News, Philadelphia. Mm, I love it, and she does so much to give back to the community as well. We are celebrating women all month long here at CBS Philadelphia. You can go to our website, cbsphiladelphia.com slash Women's History Month to see more stories of inspiring women from around the region.